Yo, what is up guys? My name's Armin and this is episode 4 of our F1 2020 My Team Career Mode using, well not using, making a Lamborghini Racing Formula 1 team. So um, in this episode we've got quite a lot to do as you'll see here we have an invitational event, I don't know what that is, but then we have two upgrades to our car coming the rear wing main plane and the central under tray then uh, we've got the Chinese Grand Prix so that should be interesting so it should be quite a long episode so yeah so first thing I want to do is I want to make my first upgrade onto Uh, let's do um, I'm gonna do the build time for the air oh actually no, I'm gonna do an upgrade for the quality control for aero which improves the failure chance um, like it reduces it by 10% so there's less chance of failure so we're gonna upgrade that that comes in after the invitational event yeah after the invitational event and then we got to do some activities so uh, first thing we are going to do is we are going to do this because um, last episode we had a go at our aero department and now they're not very happy well they're not they're, they are probably happy but they're how do I explain it? Their uh, morale is low. So next we are going to we're going to do some visiting of our sponsor headquarters which sounds quite cool. Then we've got two days which I was thinking about doing some durability team building. So yeah we got that. So um, I think we should advance. Uh, we can get 150k. Do this. Let's let's do it. Let's like see what this is. I saw Zanvolt, so I'm guessing like we're just gonna do like latch on Zanvolt. Invitational race. Okay, so we got a race here. Let's hope it's not too long. I don't know what to expect. Obviously, if it's like a proper race weekend, then it it won't be a proper race weekend. I think it'll just be like sure, and if it's not, then I'll um, cut it out. But I don't think it'll be too long. Maybe like 20 minutes. Is there going to be a cutscene here? Now, while today's classic exhibition event has no direct impact upon the Formula One World Championship, you better believe that with their reputations on the line, the drivers down there are still hungry to show that they've got what it takes to get a win. Okay, checkpoint challenge. Okay, we're using the 2010 Red Bull car, which is quite cool. 35 seconds. It's going to take 35 seconds. Pass. I'm so. You know what? Let's just. Yeah. Oh, is it like a time trial? This, this, this is pretty cool. I, I'm a big Red Bull fan as well, so driving this car is sick. Around Zandvoort as well. We got. We're, we're going to race at Zandvoort too. Huge amount of oversteer there, which is kind of uh, bad. What about RK checkpoint? 16 seconds. So we just keep doing this until we get 7.8 kilometers, which is quite a lot. So we need to be quick. It gives a good uh, practice around Zandvoort because I still haven't. Driven around Zandvoort yet. It's a cool track though. Sorry, didn't mean to do that. It's really like slidey this car, like it doesn't have much grip. You see, wow, look, look at that oversteer there. Obviously, it is an older car, so it wouldn't be as good as the current Formula 1 cars. I'm pretty sure this is uh, the car Red Bull first one there, like first of. For um, 
World Championships in, when they went on that streak before Mercedes came in and absolutely dominated. Pretty cool. Oh, it's actually quite fun driving this car. I'm enjoying it. <laughs> it's got better aero uh, dynamics than our car, for sure. Ooh, that was really close. Why am I getting so much over speed? I'm so confused. Oh, we've almost done it. We've, we've done six kilometers. This is class. I don't know if we're supposed to do it this quick, but well, we, we haven't even been here for like a minute. Actually, yeah, but that's a lot. We've been here for less than 10 minutes. Oh, I'd say this is like a five minute job. I'm having so much oversteer though, like what is going on? I mean, surely it's not the car, I think it's just me. There might be the car. I need to stop exceeding track limits. Come on, we've almost done it! Come on, the next checkpoint can't be far. Okay, we've, we've, done, we've done the limit. The next trip point there. So I just, I guess we just keep going here. I don't think we'll make the next trip point. There's not enough time. I don't even know where the next trip point is. Oh, it's right there. Oh, we were so close. Uh, that was enjoyable. We passed the um, challenge. So I think we get a good amount of money, which we need after we spent two million on our aerodynamics uh, facility upgrade and we got a thousand acclaim which is pretty good so yeah that was a quick like five minute job i enjoyed that so now we should be getting our upgrades to our car well we should but uh, there's a chance of failure there's a 40 percent chance of failure which is not good <coughs> and then um it's time for the Chinese Grand Prix. It's going to be quite a long episode, I'm guessing. So, yeah. You know what I've noticed? There's a lot of like loading time in this game. Like you have to wait a long time. Like the black screen between the like when the common is it? I guess the commentators like they say like the driver um, the grid order, and then you go to the race. That takes a long time. I just cut it out. Okay. Um, so yeah, advance. We had they both failed. Issue on the production line earlier this week, so the entire development package for this weekend has failed. Check your no. to order any redevelopments. We needed those. Oh, that's so annoying. We'll purchase that again, and that will be ready for Zanvort. And then that should be ready for Zanvort as well. That's so annoying. We needed that. I'm, I'm gonna order the, this as well. Department, oh okay, so we could do like one per department. We don't really much, we don't really much, that's not even English. We don't really have many uh, thingy R&D points, so we're gonna have to do quite a lot of practice. Um, <laughs> we're in a position now where we're able to attract a new sponsor to the team. New sponsor, oh, even more like stuff. To choose who we should approach. Qualify temple better, that's really hard. Um, let's sort it by weekly income. Um, achieve and hold for. No, I can't do that. Um, achieve, no. Score ten during no. Cheesy. Oh, that, 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 I, I want to try and do that, 
But I can't do that like regularly. Top 12, we've done that, I think. Well, we've crashed a lot of time. Qualified P10, no. Achieve fast, no. Um, no. Complete all practice. I don't complete all of them. I um, do most of them. Complete a race with no DNFs within the team. No, because uh, Juan Manuel had a thingy. And driver of the day, that would be a good one. Score more points than the team directly above you in vehicle performance. Um, oh, I've got that one already. I have a tight for oh, okay, I could do that one. Achieve top 14. That's decent. I'm gonna go with this one. I like their logo. We got like two like similar logos. Okay, let's add it to our car and then we'll actually go to the race. Uh, car livery. Sponsor decals. Uh, where do I want to add it? Uh, um, I want it. Uh, yeah, let's have it here. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It says Italia, and our team's Italian, technically. Even though I'm saying our HQ is in England. Okay, race weekend time. So yeah, uh, we're going to the race weekend now, and I will be doing the practices, and I'll see you in qualifying. So, um, we've done the three practice sessions, and I forgot to record the intro for the quali, so um, we've started qualifying, but it hasn't been long, it's been like 10 seconds of qualifying. So yeah, um, we've got three sets of softs and a medium. So, um, let's try and do well here. I, th I think we could do well. In practice, I've really enjoyed driving around this circuit. So yeah, let's um, okay. Uh, fly on lap, let's go. So yeah, um, in practice, I was actually really good. I really enjoyed this circuit. I don't know why. Something about it was really good. I think it's just because like China. So far, I've played it about five times. I used the classic cars at China. I used the. Uh, um, I had my first race at China, like when I got the game, and then um, yeah. So overall, I've really enjoyed going to China. Also, I just like the stadium part. Like, look at it; it's insane. So yeah, qualifying, and I've come really wide there. Don't mean that. It's fine. We can make it. Oh, this person's going slow in front of me. They're going slow, but yeah, I can't catch them up. Why are they going slow? Who is it? Esteban Ocon. Definitely improve on this lap. I'm um, not doing a good lap here. There's someone behind me, I think. Oh, Ocon's had a lock up and it's annoyed. It not annoyed me, it's messed me up. Oh, that's really annoying. He's really messed me up there. P4 so far, but we can go faster than that. We're gonna have to overtake Ocon, which is quite annoying. There's only one lap of fuel remaining. 
No, Ocon! I need to get past him. And it needs to be here. Ah, oh, he's really messed me up. I could have gone so much quicker. And now I'm losing time to my last lap. Just because he's in my way and I need him. That's so annoying. I'm coming in this lap. Ferrari coming, so I'm taking this uh, this side. Are they coming? They're not catching up. I like the pit entry of um, China. It's Ocon coming in as well, but he's not. Oh, the Ferrari came in as well. Who is it? I think it's Sebastian Vettel. Okay. It's quite annoying. Ocon messed up my laps. Oh, I could have done much faster laps as well. Oh, I almost dropped my controller. Okay. Let's see what we got. Ocon's still out. I'm not happy with him. Okay, let's go out now. I think we might have one or two laps, so we're going to have to hope that there's no traffic. We're currently P8, which is really good. I'm really proud of that. This could be our best qualifying here. And we're P8 with um, Ocon was in our way, so yeah. Who's that in my way? Latifi! No, come on, man. My teammate's behind me as well. I've lost time because I went to overtake Latifi. And he was very slow. Now we got Russell as well. I hate traffic, like why? See look how slow Russell's going through here, like I'm losing time for me. This is so annoying, I might as well... I was on lead anyways. Okay. Well, we're now doing a, an outlap, apparently, when it's supposed to be a flying lap. Okay, um, I struggle on turn one. I need to like learn how to do it. I've got a minute to get to the start, so yeah. I think everyone's doing their final lap. Okay, come on, let's go. Forty five seconds and we've started our last lap and we wanna go quicker. We got Kevin Magnuson in front of us, Russell behind us. I 
we're still P8. I'm surprised no one else has put a lap in yet. The thing is, we haven't actually had an upgrade, so I think it's just the power units just really good around here. Oh no, that's going to be an invalid lap. I was distracted and then, oh, that's so annoying. I was on a good lap as well. Yep, P10 now. And it's going to keep going down and down. That's so annoying. I might as well come in. I might as well finish qualifying in it. Oh, I'm not going to gain any time on here. Esteban Ocon, man. And, and he's qualified ahead of me. That's, that's... That's really annoying. Oh, I'm gonna try and not mess up Russell's lap. I'll take this side here. And my qualifying's complete here. Oh, that's annoying. P11 though, it's really good. It's our best qualifying yet. I just noticed my mic's not on the right place. So, four German. Bit weird there. With qualifying finished, it's time to remind ourselves of our top three. So we're, we've Bottas, got our best finish so far, Hamilton. and I'm gutted with, with qualifying it. Qualifying complete. All that remains is the main event. We're one tenth we'll be behind Ocon, two tenths behind tomorrow, so make sure Ricardo. You join us uh, no, Lando, and so we could have done so much better. So yeah, I will see you lot in the race. It's time to find out which driver is up to the task of claiming the Chinese Grand Prix. We're here in Shanghai. Shanghai International Circuit then, a 16-corner high-speed thrill ride. The long and ever-tightening right-hander at turns one and two tests a driver's patience. And the flat, open to the elements location, tests their skill and a crosswind. Two DRS zones will assist passing and overtaking is available into turn one and, of course, down the kilometre-long back straight into the hairpin at turn 14. And with me, as usual, is Anthony Davidson. Now, I want to ask you about Lewis Hamilton. That was a great win in the last race. Do they keep that momentum going this weekend? There are never any guarantees in this business, but certainly the performance last time out would have boosted their confidence coming into this one. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Sebastian Vettel has a clear track ahead of him today. He starts in pole position, and Valtteri Bottas will line up alongside. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Hamilton, Leclerc, Max Verstappen, and Albon, Sainz, Ricardo, Norris, and Esteban Ocon, the rookie, Perez, Daniel Kvyat, and Stroll, Raikkonen, Giovinazzi, Pierre Gasly, and Roman Grosjean, Magnussen, Russell, Correa, and Nicholas Latifi. That's it then, it's time to go racing as we head to trackside for today's race. Okay, it's race time. So we have two options here. Uh, they're both on one stop. So I soft to mediums or soft to hards. I'm going to go soft to mediums, obviously. And here um, I'm going to add an extra 0 0.5 um, of fuel. So um, we can use rich mix a lot in the the back straight so yeah let's go that was a formation that I almost did the same thing any technical issues coming off the practice start watch the RPM on the full start we don't want to bog down I understand Esteban Ocon, I'm not too happy with you right now. So if I can overtake in the race, I definitely will. But P11, best qualifying yet. And then we have a really good chance of getting points. I really feel like our car is really good around trying. 
I was really tempted just to hit the side of the at the moment. No rain currently expected. The thing is, uh, I've seen like other YouTubers do Formula One, yeah. and they don't do it formation. Like, I don't know why. <laughs> I just feel like it's just a cool thing to do. Obviously, it's quite annoying going really slow. I just like it. I don't know why. We're ahead of Sergio Perez and then our rival Daniel Kavir. Last race we had a safety car, which was quite cool. In the game's gonna take over this part. There you go. Okay, race time now. Come on. I really wanna get some points. Especially now, if we get points, we get our bonus goal of um, finishing top 15. So we get extra money. There's a the lot of people behind will us. Begin as soon as the grid has formed. Be ready with the clutch. I am ready. Whew. Come on. Uh. Oh, it's a really bad start for us. Or is it nice and decent? Ockham's already trying to squeeze us. What? I've just been hitting the rear already. And it wasn't even my fault. Why am I not surprised? It was with Ocon. We always have a rival in a race, don't we? Australia, it was um, Giovinazzi, then it was Bahrain, it was probably Ocon or Perez. Oh, that's bad. And then um, Vietnam, we had Viking then. That front wing is really annoying actually. I need to pay attention, I talk too much. When I practice, I just don't crash because I don't talk. Let's hope there's no last lap chaos either, as there has been in the last two races. Ah, oh, the broken front is not going to help us through here, is it? Alright, we're looking good so far. They are looking good to be fair, like... We've had a broken front wing, but that's it. It's not broken, it's just a bit damaged. Come on, can we get Daniel Ricardo here? Perfect. You're in the top ten now, keep it up. I'm ninth, I'm really happy. Yellow flag is something I have, and it's not good. And it looks like Max Verstappen has a problem. Max Verstappen, oh, he's retiring. Green flag. Already two laps in, Max Verstappen is. Oh, good defending from Ricardo. Oh, he brake tested me there. But then I didn't too often, so it's kind of fair. That's looking even more like I could get some points here, and it could be some decent points as well. 
But I generally think we can overtake Ricardo and I've got my Okay, we've got plenty of energy. Use the overtake button and have a go. Well, Ocon is pressurizing us really aggressively, you know. It's gonna be hard to get um, get through this. Come on, Ocon, leave us alone, man. I generally thought he was going to dive down the inside and take the risk. Oh, that front wing is really annoying me. Such an annoying mistake. The pit window, you'll be on the mediums. Go around the outside of Ocon, maybe. And then on the inside, and we've got the move done back ahead of Ocon. We didn't get moved on, we were defending, but we defended pretty well. How long can we defend against Ocon? The engine is going to be down slightly, it's showing some minor wear. No, I, don't, I need power, I generally need power. Especially around this circuit, especially um, across the back straight. Power is so important. Take mode and rich mix. Let's try and get Ricardo, even though that probably went up. Like Ocon's got DRS on us, I think. We're going to go defensive and he's going to go on the inside. But we break later than him. We try and defend it off. He's still there and I think we've defended it once again. That was a nice turn. Really nice turn. Ricardo's getting quite far away from us now. Like he's gaining lots of time. We try need we need to try and get it within one second, use his DRS. If we get his DRS we could defend against Ocon. This front wing's really not helping me. And just like that, Ocon's right on my tail. And we've gone wide. Okay, gap ahead is 1.9 seconds. Nah, no, I don't think we're gonna catch Daniel Ricardo. How long can I defend with this front window? I think Ocon's gonna get me here. Ah, this is so annoying. Has to be Esteban Ocon as well, doesn't it? No, I was going to dive down his inside. Oh, loads of those guys are picking up. We're boxing, and I'm guessing Ocon's going to box this lap as well. So we need to overtake him before we get to the pits. And we've seen how quick the Renault could go away from us with Ricardo. So we don't want Ocon to go too far away from us either. Well, then we're going to be fighting Norris, and Norris is in the McLaren, and I don't have a good history of McLarens. 
as seen at the Barland Grand Prix. Bottas is up in first place. Oh no, we're getting pressurized by Norris. And just like that, Ocon's gone and we're fighting Norris. Come on, that was, that was a nice fight, outside overtake. When, we're not even a whole second behind uh, Ocon, so we can't get his DRS. Come on, just be ahead at this part against Norris. We could be late on the brakes again. He's trying to go side by side with us. And it really hasn't worked for him. Oh, the front wing is so broken. You know what? Taken two in one at the pick. Exit because we caught them napping. Now we're on Gasly's tail. Gasly's gone the hard times. It's quite interesting. We appeared at the same time, I'm pretty sure. Maybe he feels like the tire wear is not very good on the Alpha Tower. I'm really bad at taking corners flat out. Come on, I really, really want a P um, a point. Just like, it's like a couple, a point. But even if it's just P10 and we get one point, I'll take it. But we're faster, we, we've got, we're the faster Honda powered car. Come on, how. Okay, surely we've got in there. The track is clear. Green flag. Teammate in the pits. Oh, we've won really wide. Coming in for his stop. That means more people are coming in for their pit stop. and everyone's made their pit stop. We need to overtake three more people. Who include Perez, Ocon, and then probably Norris, I would imagine. No, it's Perez, Ocon, and I think that's a pin dot, so it's got to be strong. We've got to overtake racing points, lovely. The pink Mercedes themselves. Well, 
Oh no, they are being held up in a long train. And one of them might have an issue. All I'm saying is, because we broke our front wing, it cost us. It cost us P7, because I feel like we could have got Ricardo. Well, we've caught up to the train though. Now we just need to overtake them. How come we're not getting DRS? Uh, DRS. We're that right behind them. I don't have much of your eyes. We just hit a purple last sector. That's mad. Obviously it's gonna be overtaken. Oh, there's a gap there. No comment. We, we've stayed behind them though. That could have gone so much worse for us. Come on Perez, move man! You're literally a human chicane right in front of me. Look, a brick wall I can't get past. And the thing is, I'm faster than the racing point. I, I, I didn't actually expect that. I thought I'd be slower. I generally think we're the fastest car in this train. not many laps left either. Yes, we're going to get the RS3. So is Perez though. I, I'm going to die. Yes, it's worked. What a dive down the inside. Come on. Now Esteban Ocon, our rival right for this Good race. Good job, nice overtake. Thanks, Jeff. Jeff told us a nice overtake. Gap to teammate behind is 13.4 seconds. Come on, Stroll and Ocon, that's all we need to overtake and we can get some points. Oh, what an overtake. We've got Ocon, now we just need to get strong. Okay, we're monitoring somewhere on the ICE. Be aware that we will start to see a loss of power. A loss of no. No, no, not a loss of power. No, the, the driver in this game is insane. Someone tried to go side by side with me there. Jeff, why do you have to give me bad news? And also, we've got literally no ERS. Ocon's catching up. Come on, Stroll is right there.
have five laps of fuel remaining. We're right on Stroll's tail. Lando Norris has done us wonders though. He's kept like this train which has kept Ocon, Perez and um, Stroll like, really slow. Although well, saying that, I, I'm in the train as well. But I generally feel like I'm, because of this train, I'm actually faster than all of them. And we should be getting DRS through here as well. Which is good. We're on single fingers for ERS. Come on, come on. I see clouds as well, that's not good. Come on. We get so close to Stroll, but we can't overtake him. Did my engine is change or something? It doesn't really feel like it. DRS through here. So is Edo. This is so annoying. Oh, that's dodgy. But we've somehow kept it in. I was seeing science flashbacks. Oh, this pace is strong, but we got aware, three laps to go the distance to overtake strong. Like, I, I, I will overtake strong, and I don't mind not overtaking Norris because it will be our first point, and we don't want to be There's winning. It's getting no traction. I'm winning for one point last season. Oh, massive dive! It's worked! Okay, 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 come on. Come on, come on, come on. Now we need to pull away. Come on, Norris. Come on, Norris. Let me just be in your DRS. And then we can be best friends. No, 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 Stroll, come on, man. I'm gonna defend him. Norris is gonna get DR, uh, not Norris, uh, Stroll's gonna get DRS from here. I got DRS as well, though.
Como? No. There's only one lap of fuel remaining. Come on, it's the last lap. I'm having this five flashbacks. Look where flashbacks. Come on. Come on, Norris. Just take me your DRS. Norris has got an absolute one that's us at this race. Like, my own take for one of the cleaners, but come on, you can't have all, you can't always have the cleaners, I think. I had some clean overtakes in Vietnam and had it down. Oh, come on, come on, come on. This is this is the important part. Can Stroll catch up to me here? They're using all the power. <gasps> no, 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 no. I'm so sorry, Norris. I did not mean it. <gasps> We're gonna get a. Put we do not deserve P9. I apologise to Norris. Oh my days, we've got our first points and we're getting two points. Oh, I'm so sorry Norris. Norris done absolute wonders for us. And we did that too at the end of the lap. I didn't even mean it. Brakes were really bad at the end. Here's our winner. Oh, wow. What a fantastic race it was. What do you think it was, Hans, that gave them the edge over the competition today? Well, they certainly stood out as a drive with tons of confidence on the track. I think their ability to keep their cool, even during some of the more hectic parts of the race, meant they were able to capitalize on the mistakes of other drivers, giving them the opportunity to make their way to the top spot with ease. Here come our winners now. A thrilling race and a tremendous effort by Ferrari. Their history is well known, so it's no surprise to fans the world over to see them come out on top once again. Wow. Let's see what effect this result has I had can't believe on the I've done to Norris. Well, I feel so bad. Been cut down after a difficult race today for our championship leader. After an incredible Look, day of it's racing, me, who P9. was your driver of the day? The points, Sebastian two Buffett points to us. First choice. He showed up a lot of the drivers out on the track today and didn't show any signs of slowing down. We Let's moved move up to, to the 14th. The current it's championship uh, leader still thing. hold top spot, but that gap is getting smaller. It was also a strong Grand Prix from Haas F1 this weekend. Fantastic work from the American team to move themselves further up the table. Well, that was certainly an incredible weekend of racing. Be sure to join myself and Ant for more exciting Formula One action soon. We have finished. Uh, we finished P9. We've moved up to 14th. And look at that. P9. 
eight in constructor championship. What a Grand Prix for us! Ah, oh, after the heartbreaking Bahrain, the heartbreaking Vietnam. Now this, we deserve this. Ah, oh, I am so happy. Ah, oh, that's unbelievable. What a race. We got some interview questions there. Let's have yours. Your team must be ecstatic with how you're performing. Oh, I'm so happy about that. Uh, uh, I like both of you. I'm gonna do that one. I am so happy. You had a close battle today, didn't you? Uh, too close. It was more like dodgems than Formula One today, wasn't it? Was it? Uh, to be fair, yeah. I wouldn't go as far as that. I'd take it a bit easier in the future. You're right. With orders. Nah, no, that's a bit harsh. Yeah, let's just go that one. <laughs> Your time. Thank you. I got my first two points in one race as well. I'm so happy with that. That's made up for Bahrain and Vietnam. 3-3 three, three against Vingy. Kavia finished ahead of me. Oh no. I'm going to lose this rivalry. Oh yes, we made 298k from this race. Obviously damage for the front wing. Okay. I'm so happy. And next race we get both our upgrades. Which is absolutely amazing. I'm so I'm a wow. I can't believe it. After everything we've been through, we have done it. Yeah. Uh, we've got quite a bit of time, but that's for the next episode. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, like and subscribe. See you later.